What's up guys, it's Vera, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to pretend I'm Amber. That was so bad, right? <laughs> wow, I'm not gonna try to do that again. Hey beautiful, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you uh, how I... Um... What? Today I'm going to recreate Amber's signature makeup. She wears this makeup every single day, every time, always forever <laughs> so in this video I'm going to show you how I achieve this makeup I'm not really a fan of how my eyes look like I don't know I feel like this liner makes my eyes look a little bit weird and I'm talking about the inner corner situation but other than that I feel like this is a super easy makeup look to achieve uh, she's more into matte full coverage foundations i do like a more natural glowy looking foundation that's because i have dry skin oh and also she loves like nude matte lips nose hella contoured chin inexistent like you cannot see my double chin okay oh and also i have this huge piece of hair extensions it's so heavy my head hurts it's so messy because it's synthetic hair and that's normal but you cannot see that now amber loves long hair long ponytails she looks amazing anyway so if you guys want to see how i created this makeup look simple easy full glam amber signature makeup look thank you for watching wow i'm all over the place okay so first i'm going to start by doing my eyebrows and this is a trick that i learned from amber and she also has a video if you guys want to check that out she has a video where she shapes this hair is so heavy i have like a very long extension up to my butt and uh, it's hella heavy i might have to take it down i don't know man it's so heavy and she wears this type of extensions all the time my head hurts my scalp hurts so yeah she shaved the end of the brows and made them a little bit more straight and this will give you the illusion of facelift you know so very fast i'm going to do my eyebrows i'm going to speed this part and uh, no worries i'm going to have all the products listed down below very quick i'm going to do my skincare routine because i need some moisture so I'm starting with this Clinique eye cream that Nicole Guerrero swears by it. Nicole Guerrero. Gu wow, sorry, I'm sorry for that. It's this one. Next I'm going to go with this hyaluronic acid from Good Molecules. This is so good. If you guys haven't tried anything from Good Molecules, I recommend you the hyaluronic acid and the cleansing balm. It's a balm to remove your makeup. Oh my god. The bomb.com you guys need to try this brand because it's so affordable and all the products are super clean i love it cruelty free vegan oh my god amazing i have a link down below if you guys want to check that out is an affiliate link i will earn a little commission if you guys want to purchase through my link i'm going to take off my rings so yeah you guys need to try good molecules And next I'm going to go with this Duo Moisturizer. This also has hyaluronic acid, which I really love. This is amazing, but it's so bad expensive. I got this and look fantastic. Because I can't afford paying 100 and something euros on a 50 milliliters face cream. Like, what? <laughs> no. But it's nice to try expensive stuff. What did you guys bought on Black Friday? I mostly bought makeup and clothing. And I don't want to say this, but I think I placed five, five orders on Shein. Five. <laughs> I did purchase some gifts. So I didn't buy everything for myself, you know. I bought some gifts too. Anyway, I'm going with primer. For foundation I'm going to go with the double wear just because I want full coverage and we all know Amber she's all about that bit face so yeah I'm going to go with this one and I'm going to use again the wet n wild sponge I think this soaks too much product and I don't like that that's my chair I swear to you I don't know what's going on in this chair 
it's so annoying very fast i'm going to blend this and as we can see as we can see oh my god this sponge anyway i'm going to use it now i forgot that this foundation doesn't work well with cream products like cream counter cream blush anyway let's see how that goes so now i'm going to make the magic happen i'm going to counter the sh out of my face because i'm going to make myself look like amber even though we are so different you see like i have double chin she doesn't have double chin i have big nose she doesn't have big nose i have small eyes she doesn't have small eyes i have forehead wrinkles she doesn't have that so it's going to be a challenge Let's work this double chin. Next I'm going to take a little bit of this skin gloss and I'm going to use it as a, I don't know, blush, highlight, whatever. Okay, Amber likes hella blinding highlight so i'm trying to achieve that too next i'm going to go with concealer and i'm going to use the joue concealer and a little bit of the she glam this has more coverage than the she glam one and probably you're asking why did you went with the blush highlight whatever and now you're applying concealer on top i don't know bitch i guess i'm dumb ah uh, yeah that was a mistake it's okay Also, I give myself a little bit of moustache counter. I don't know if you can see that. Mm. Now I'm going to go again with that blush highlight. Just a little bit more. And a little bit of this concealer as well. I thought it was a little bit more bright, but anyway. To set my concealer, I'm going to go with the Beauty Bakery Flower Powder. What the heck, camera? Something looks bad under my eyes. I don't know what happened there. Probably these two concealers don't work well together. But that won't stop me to continue with my makeup, okay? Wow, look at my lids. I think this foundation doesn't work well with one of these concealers. What the heck? I'm going to try to apply a little bit more of concealer. You go, girl. Keep looking cute, okay? I don't want you to be ugly. You are doing well. Just do your thing. Okay, you need to stop acting shady right now. Yeah, I think this foundation doesn't work well with one of these concealers. Okay, moving on. I'm going to go with more bronzer because we need to be snatched so i'm going to go with the butter bronzer and i was planning to wear this hoodie for the intro and stuff but i think i'm going to change with something more amber style a little bit more skin showing <laughs> i would absolutely love to be amber's friend <sighs> she's so beautiful inside out you guys and from far you can tell she has a good soul and she's always so uplifting so positive so energetic and i don't know how she does it because i have bad days mostly every day <laughs> cheers to that i don't know she vibrates this good energy and uh, i mean this is what i'm getting from watching her videos and watching her on social media but she vibrates this good energy this positivity and i don't know i feel attracted to that she has a beautiful colorful aura i can i can tell that yeah she's amazing i know she does this speech high voice and it can be a little bit annoying i'm not gonna lie at first when i found her youtube channel i thought why does she talk like that like she sounds like mickey mouse and she really does but is excitement that's why she does it i guess uh and i totally understand her like when i'm excited i probably do that too and i don't even realize it but other than that she's amazing she's a beautiful person inside out also not mentioning the fact that she looks absolutely fire like wow she looks amazing and also her confidence is my goal <laughs> 
<laughs> I'd love to have her confidence. I know she's not using that much blush or she's not using at all, but I'm going to go with a little bit of blush. I think I just spent like three, four minutes talking about how amazing Amber is, but she's really amazing, you guys. You have to follow her. So I'm going with a little bit of blush. Oh, maybe that's too much. So I'm going to take a fluffy brush and I'm going to go with the bronzer and I'm going to kind of define my crease also I'm going to connect it with my nose contour just to give a little bit of definition in there you know Okay, next I'm going to go with a lot of highlight First I'm going to start with this one from Il Masqua This is in the shade Oh my god This is a little bit more natural I would say but looks so nice on the skin so I'm starting with this one and next I'm going to go with Anastasia and Nicole and I think I'm going to mix this two. Oh wow you guys see that I'm not gonna move it too much because I want the light to be boom in that spot all right Wow. Anyway, next I'm going to move with the wing liner and wish me luck with that. She does her wings a little bit more thin and long. I'm going to try to achieve that. But as I said, she does the cat eye situation in the inner corner and my eyes are not shaped for that. But I'm going to try. I'm going to use the She Glam Eyeliner. Yeah, as we can see here, how gorgeous she is. Oh my God. So I'm going to try to achieve that. Bang. I don't know. Oh wait, I haven't liked this picture. Sorry Amber, I'm sorry. Again, another close-up. Um, yeah. Next I'm going to water, what? <laughs> Next I'm going to line my waterline and uh, wish me luck. <sighs> oh, it looks weird because I have small eyes. Look at that. That, that. That's not the vibe. That's not the vibe. I... Okay. Small steps. Anyway, I'm going to go with Colourpop lip liners. I have the Skimpy one and BFF, I don't know why I grabbed both of them. So I'm going to go with Skimpy first. And I'm going to try to achieve that pout lips. I think we are getting there. I'm going to fill in my lips with this lip liner. I'm going to take a little bit of foundation, I'm going to correct that, but I guess this is as much as I can exaggerate with my lips because it's gonna look weird if I go with more lip liner, right? So I'm taking a little bit of foundation and I'm going to correct my lips. Alright guys, so I think um, this makeup is ready. This top is so annoying. It's so cute though, but the shoulders doesn't want to stay, you know, like that. Uh, I know she likes to wear a lot of rings. Uh, let's pretend I have some Dior earrings, um, you know, necklace, whatever. Uh, this top though, can you not? As I said, my eyes are not shaped for this type of makeup because look at that. The black is starting to transfer right here and right here. So my eyes can't handle this uh, wing liner situation, but I 
feel like I freaking nailed it. It looks like I have a lot of makeup. I think it's the foundation. I'm not really a fan. So yeah, let me know down below if you guys follow Amber, if you like her videos. As I said, she has a very positive energy. She inspires me. To be completely honest she inspires me anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know down below what do you think and um that's it i'm going to take some cute pictures and see if it pictures nice this makeup i'm not as sexy as she is even though i wish i'm not confident so yeah her confidence is my goal i'm not by any means comparing myself with her like we are both beautiful in our way. There's no comparison. Com compar comparison. How do you say that? I'm not by any means comparing my appearance with hers. She's beautiful inside out. I'm beautiful inside out. And I know that. And I hope you guys will get to uh, find out too. Uh, I don't even know what I'm talking about anyway i hope you guys enjoyed please subscribe if you haven't already take care and i will see you in my next one bye guys